Here are Arsenal players' salaries per week in 2024. 1. Kai Havertz German footballer Kai Havertz is Arsenal's highest paid player. The attacking midfielder earns over £280,000 weekly following his arrival from Chelsea. Contract till June 2028. 2. Gabriel Jesus Gabriel Jesus is the second highest earning player at Arsenal. The Brazilian striker is currently on a deal that pays him £265,000 a week and £14 million annually. Jesus was acquired by Arsenal from Manchester City in 2022 on a five-year contract that expires in June 2027. 3. Declan Rice Perhaps one of the best signings in the English Premier League this season, Declan Rice has shown that Arsenal's £105 million investment was worth it. The midfielder earns £240,000 per week on a contract till June 2028. 4. Martin Udegaard Martin Udegaard is the captain of the team. He earns around £240,000 weekly on a contract till June 2028. His decision to join the Gunners has paid off as he is now one of the most outstanding midfielders in the English Premier League. 5. Thomas Partey Thomas Partey is a Ghanaian midfielder. He earns around £200,000 per week and over £10 million yearly. Partey was bought by Arsenal in 2020 from Spanish giants Atletico Madrid. He is currently on a deal that would keep him at Arsenal till 2025. 6. Bukayo Saka Bukayo Saka is one of the new generation wingers with his versatility, speed and consistency which makes him stand out. He recently signed a new contract of £195,000 per week till June 2027. 7. William Saliba Saliba has been ranked as one of the best centre-backs in the English Premier League with his consistency in the team. He earns £190,000 weekly on a contract that will take him to 2027. 8. Gabriel Martinelli Martinelli committed his future to the club last year as he signed a new deal with the club until 2027 on weekly wage of £180,000. Nine, Oleksandr Zinchenko. The Ukrainian left back has been paid 150,000 pounds weekly. Zinchenko was bought in 2022 from Manchester City on a four-year deal that runs till 2026. Ten, Aaron Ramsdale. Aaron Ramsdale becomes the second-choice goalkeeper at the club. He was previously the most preferred before the arrival of David Rea, who is on loan from Brentford will be at the club till 2026 on a deal of £120,000 weekly. 11. Ben White Ben White earns around £120,000 a week and £6 million annually at Arsenal. The English defender was bought by Arsenal from Brighton and Hove Albion in 2021 on a four-year deal that would keep him at the club till 2025. 12. Jorginho the Italian has been impressive when called upon. He is in the final year of his contract on £110,000 per week. 13. Edward Nkidia The striker signed a five-year deal worth a cool £100,000 per week in the summer of 2022. The 24-year-old has hit the back of the net 34 times in 137 matches in a red shirt. 14. Gabriel Magalhães Gabriel established himself as one of the Premier League's best centre-backs during the 2022-2023 season. Arsenal fans will be relieved that the Brazilian signed a contract last year on £100,000 per week that will keep him at the club until 2027. 15. Reese Nelson The Englishman was rewarded with a four-year deal this summer after a string of impressive performances off the bench in the 2022-2023 campaign. He earns around £100,000 weekly on a contract till June 2027. 16. Leandro Trossard After missing out on Mikhailo Mudrik, Arsenal turned their attentions to Trossard, and the Belgian joined in a £27 million move from Brighton. He earns around £90,000 weekly 
on a contract till June 2026. 17. Cedric Suarez The Portuguese defender spent the second half of the 22-23 season at Fulham. His days at Arsenal looked to be numbered with Ben White, Tomiyasu and Timber all capable of playing right back and above him in the picking order. He earns £90,000 weekly and in the final year of his contract. 18. Jurian Timber Timber was mightily impressive at Ajax and that convinced Arteta to sign him in a £34 million deal. The 22-year-old, who is capable of playing both centre-back and right-back, has signed a contract that will keep him at the club until 2028, earning £90,000 per week. 19. David Raya Arteta has brought his compatriot to the club on loan initially with the view to making the deal permanent in the future. Raya has already forced his way into the starting lineup, despite Aaron Ramsdale's impressive form in 2022-2023 season, earning £85,000 per week. 20. Jakub Kivior Kivior signed a five-and-a-half-year contract with Arsenal when he joined the club in January on a salary of £58,000 per week until June 2028. He made just eight appearances in his opening season for the club. 21. Takahiro Tomiyasu The Japanese international is expected to continue as a backup fullback, having already played at both left-back and right-back so far this season. He is also more than capable of playing at the heart of the defense, £56,000 per week until June 2025. 22. Mohamed El Nini The Egyptian's contract expires in 2024, meaning there is a strong possibility he will be on the move in the summer after new additions in his position. Earning £55,000 per week. 23. Fabio Vieira Vieira didn't hit the heights expected of him during his first campaign at Arsenal. The diminutive Portuguese midfielder played 32 times in his debut season for the club, scoring twice. He earns around £45,000 weekly on a contract till June 2027. 24. Emile Smith-Rowe he made just 14 appearances for Arsenal in an injury-hit 2022-2023 campaign and has yet to feature in the league during this term. He earns around £40,000 weekly on a contract till June 2026. 25. Marquinhos Arsenal recalled Marquinhos from his loan spell with Nantes. The winger has since been on a training camp with the Brazil youth team. He earns around £20,000 weekly, on a contract till June 2028. 26. Carl Hein Despite only making a handful of first-team appearances for Arsenal, Hein is an international goalkeeper with Estonia. His contract is up at the end of this season, and Arsenal intend to offer him a new one. £10,000 per week. Finally, Arsenal manager Mikel Arteta managed to get a salary increase in the middle of 2022, and this has reportedly meant that he now earns £8.3 million a year. This is around £158,000 a week and is a huge amount for the manager. This adds a lot of pressure on him to be performing well at the club. With so much money available to give to Michael Arteta, fans of the Gunners will be hoping that the owners start splashing the cash more to buy players. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and click on the notification bells for more video on your favorite sport. Until the next one, please stay tuned.